and salutation. Feet planted into the ground, tailbone drawing downwards, suck the belly button in, hands by your side, keep those shoulders rolled down, shoulder blades almost like they're about to kiss. Chin parallel to the floor. On the inhale, take the arms up and over the head, looking up to the hands as you exhale forward fold and bringing your hands down to the floor, bending your knees as much as you need to to get the hands down. Now on the inhale, take your um, fingertips so that they're touching the floor, have a nice straight strong back looking straight in front of you and as you exhale forward fold over the legs, keeping them nice and straight, feeling that stretch in the hands, hamstring, you may not be able to get your hands on the floor, that's absolutely fine, put them on the shins or ask for blocks, so you can put your hands on blocks if you want to. From here you can either jump back or step back into plank, so step back into your high plank, you want your um, hands to be underneath your shoulders, suck that belly button in so not, you're not like sinking into your back and if you push the weight into the heels, you'll be able to activate your glutes, which will help you um, support your lower back so it's not getting injured. As you exhale, you lower yourself to the floor, keeping the elbows nice and tucked in, and gently lower yourself into the floor. And then from here, you're gonna push away from the floor, looking just forward of your mat. My um, feet are active, I'm pulling my toes away from my head. And as I exhale, I come back down into the floor. Tuck the toes under, use, you can use hands now, to push up almost into a, a box position. And then from here, you're gonna go into downward dog. So push the pelvis up towards the ceiling, place the feet about hip distance apart, hands about just wider than your shoulders. You want your middle finger to be um, facing forwards on your mat. Really try and get equal pressure through both of those hands. And then it's up to you, you can try and draw the heels down to the floor if you want to. You can walk the feet out a bit, or you can have a little sway from side to side. Typically, yoga teachers will have you stay still and take five breaths here. Remember to breathe. Um, shake out any tension in the head, yes and no. And then from here, you're going to look forwards towards your hands, and you can either step forwards or you can jump if you want to, bringing the feet up to meet the hands. And then from here, you're gonna take your half fold again. So fingertips come to the floor, nice straight strong back as you look forward of your mat. Exhale, forward fold, um, letting the head become heavy over the legs, feeling that stretch down the hamstrings now, hinging at the waist. And then as you inhale, take the arms up and over, come up with a straight strong back, being mindful of your lower back, don't sink into it like this. Keep that belly button tucked into the, um, tucked in as you come all the way up as you inhale. And then exhale, hands come either down by your side or back to prayer. Yeah.